Did you know that the most important part of your entire body is your central nervous system? Your central nervous system, also known as the master system, is made up of your brain and your spinal cord, and it controls every single function in your entire body. In fact, your central nervous system is so important that it's the only body part that is totally encased in bone for its protection. Starting at the top is your brain. And your brain is the central processing unit of your body. And it coordinates and computes all the electrical signals that are sent throughout your nervous system and your entire body. So from your brain, electrical impulses or signals are sent down your spinal cord and travel all the way to the base of your spine. And branching off of your spinal cord are these fine thread-like structures called spinal nerves. And they exit between the vertebrae of the spinal column to supply all your muscles, cells, and organs. And from there, the electrical impulses are sent back up to the brain in a feedback loop. And at every level in your spine, the exiting spinal nerves supply specific muscles and organs. For instance, starting from your lower back, these spinal nerves supply such structures as your legs, reproductive organs, bladder, kidneys, and colon. As we move up the spine to the upper back or thoracic spine, the exiting spinal nerves supply such organs as your liver, stomach, heart, and lungs. Moving up further to your neck, these nerves supply such structures as your eyes, ears, throat, and arms. Now, in a healthy spine, your spinal bones or vertebrae are in proper alignment, and the cushioning or shock absorbers between the vertebrae, called intervertebral discs, are thick and healthy. As such, correct spinal movement is possible and the spinal nerves are able to freely exit the spine, sending nerve impulses from the brain to the targeted muscles and organs without any interference. However, from poor posture, falls, a car accident, or some other injury, your vertebrae can become misaligned. This misalignment is what chiropractors call vertebral subluxation complex, or just subluxation. When a subluxation occurs, your vertebrae can then press on these existing spinal nerves and interfere and block these nerve impulses. When this happens, nerve damage begins and your body starts to dysfunction. Although potentially painless at first, symptoms can develop rapidly. And when a subluxation is left untreated, your spine begins to decay, your discs begin to thin and wear down, and your vertebrae start to deform and degenerate, leading to the development of these spurs, or osteophytes, which then further compresses and damages your nerves. So when a subluxation occurs in your lower back, it can cause back pain, sciatica, bladder weakness, irritable bowel syndrome, and erectile dysfunction. A subluxation in your upper back can cause respiratory problems, digestive problems, and decreased energy levels. And subluxations in your neck can cause headaches, dizziness, tinnitus, carpal tunnel syndrome, numbness, tingling, and weakness to one or both of your arms. Fortunately, chiropractic can help. In fact, chiropractors are the only healthcare professionals that are specifically and adequately trained to detect and correct vertebral subluxations. And through a series of precise chiropractic adjustments, your chiropractor will restore your spine's proper alignment, remove nerve interference, and return your body to its optimal health. And it's important to note, your body has the ability to heal itself, so long as there is no interference. So, having a healthy spine is not just about removing pain and symptoms, but achieving your body's maximum health potential.